Okay, for this next tape job, we're going to do medial arch support or longitudinal arch support, otherwise also uh, referred to as low die taping. Um, we're going to be supporting the arch and mimicking the plantar fascia. So we're going to still spray as well, and then we're also going to use heel and lace pads on the back of the uh, heel. So just a, a heel pad, not a lace pad. I'm going to spray the bottom of the foot. The top as well. Uh, with the square, we're only going to need half of it, so we can just fold it in half, or just use scissors, or just rip it in half. Put that in the back. Can you slide down just a little bit for me? Just a little bit. Good, right there. And we're going to put that on the heel. And it's not quite sticking yet, so just spray that. Spray has to dry a little bit. Become tacky before you can apply anything on it. There we go. Our first anchor strip is going to go from around the from the uh, base of the first around the foot to the base to the uh, head of the fifth. Sorry, head of the first to head of the fifth. That's an anchor strip. Next anchor strip is going to be applied along the heads of the metatarsals. And it's on a bit of an angle. And then you're going to continue on to the top of the foot. You can get the top of this. This is a little trick to get around the baby toe. Is if you rip, and you want to make sure that these aren't too tight. If you do these too tight, this will compress the met heads. And as you can see there, and that will cause a lot of pain. If I rip that, I can get a nicer angle and lay down my strip. What we're going to do, we already have our anchor strips on. Uh, we have our heel, heel pad on the back. That's just to reduce some friction. We're going to use a half strip of the tape. So you can use one inch, or if you take a regular one and a half inch, and just rip it in half, and then we're going to use half strips. And so what we're going to do is go from the uh, heads of the metatarsals and looping around the foot, around the arch. So we're going to start at the... the first and go from one around the heel. Careful not to get that too tight on the back. Foot also has to be kept in a very relaxed position. Toes sometimes curl depending on how much uh, uh, support you need on the plantar fascia. So keep that foot relaxed. And then to the head of the fifth. There's a few different techniques for this. You could, you could also go after you do that first one, go over to the third. Um, I'm just going to continue going from first to first, second to second, and all the way down to the fifth. So I'm just going to continue my strips down. And sometimes, depending on the, the uh, width of the actual tape you're using, you may use more than five strips um, to, to make the whole bottom of the foot being covered by fascia. Half, kind of half figure eight strips. And this tape job does take some time, so you've got to take your time to be able to lie down the tape uh, evenly. And I'll do one more. There. Now once I've done that, formed my arch support, now what I'm going to do is cl start closing it in. So I'll reapply an anchor along the heads of the metatarsals, applying the very same technique that I did in the first strip. First anchor where I may rip it around the fifth just to get it to lie a little flatter. And I'm also going to do an anchor around the heel again as well. And then after this, I'm going to proceed to do close-in strips. So there's two different directions of close-in strips I'm doing, or two different layers, I should say, of close-in strips. The first layer, layer will go from the anchor on the lateral side of the heel. The key here is always we're trying to pull up that medial longitudinal arch. So I'm going to go from the lateral side of the heel across the arch. As I get to the arch, I'm going to give it a little bit of a tug, and I'm going to end on the top of the foot, halfway up the foot. Overlap by half, I'm going to continue on down. And, and that's good there. Continuing. Give a little bit of a tug on that medial longitudinal arch. 
and ending at the halfway point. I'm going to, I'm going to go down to about the tape meets at the heel. Um, depending on the length of the foot, that might be three strips, might be four strips, maybe even be more. Um, but that's as far as I'm going to go. If it goes a little bit further, that's okay, but I want to go to at least that point. So once I've done that first layer, I'm going to do another layer, and this will involve closing in the top. So I'm actually going to start halfway at the foot, so at the, on the bottom of the foot, at the halfway point down the foot, and then I'm going to go around the top, I'm going to go all the way over to the lateral anchor. Can you get a shot of the top? And it's at the other lateral anchor. So now I'm going to close in this whole top. So I'm going to continue from the halfway and the bottom of the heel, give that a little bit of a tug, and then ending at that lateral anchor. And continually overlapping by half, and it closes it in. Tape jump. Once I'm done there, I'm just going to squish everything down, heat it up, and that's my ankle. My arch tape job.